Hello, welcome back to Monster Train. Today I am joined by... I Well, we, we had a little bit of a preamble before mm -hmm. yep. recording about Harry Potter actors. Yeah, because I, uh, I, we we... I was playing Jackbox and I got a bunch of Harry Potter questions today. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And um, you, you originally thought you only knew two, but you actually discovered you knew four of the actors in it. But yeah. I you know, selected one that you didn't know. So we could learn something today. I am Ron Weasley, aka Rupert Grint. Yeah, I, 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 if you if you showed me that name, I would have said yeah, it's definitely Ron Weasley. Mm -hmm. When you when you tell he me that, he looks I, like a Rupert. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, a hundred percent. Definite Rupert energy. The other the other character in Harry Potter that I want to know who's what the name of the actor is is uh, Draco, Draco Malfoy. Draco, I, so I, I I occasionally skim Reddit mm -hmm. every once in a while, and I saw that he had like a weird like fake controversy about how people were like saying he was grooming uh, Emma Watson when they were in Harry Potter, uh -huh. and they're like almost the same age. So it was yeah, like, what the fuck are you people talking about? <laughs> uh huh. So it was just kind of it was kind of like, what are you people doing? Leave me alone. <laughs> yeah. But I I you know I don't know the details about it. He might still be a scumbag. I like I I just saw that one time, the end. Yeah. He's got a he's got a he's got a name that also looks like he's Draco too. I forget mm. what his name was as well, but he looks like his name also matches his character. And I guess we can save that for next week, except we'll definitely forget this because it's Tuesday and we're probably oh. not gonna record again for a week and a half. Yeah, million million percent. We're recording a bit early because I'm going on vacation. Yeah, we're just very going, exciting. I have done a to the beach. Ooh, very exciting. Should be fun. I've done legit like zero backlog preparations. I got to do all of that like today and tomorrow. That's gonna be fun. That's me. Um, I did that. Yeah, it was awful. It's gonna be fun to do. I recorded yeah, like um, recorded like twelve hours of Monster Train in a twenty-four hour period. Yeah, I, I might I might just like be a little lazy and like do uh, like alternating Rogue Book and Monster Train while I'm gone instead. So I have to do like half the videos. Yeah, I mean you pump out a lot of content. Yeah. You you put out like two oh, videos a day, three videos a day, right? Right now it's just two, mm -hmm. um, but I'm not streaming at all. So you're like you're like streaming almost every day, and then also you're doing the videos. So like you know, yeah, you're doing you're doing more than me probably in general. It's not a competition. It is. Just... I've lost. I'll I'll fight you. All right. Although one of one of us has the freaking world world champion running Snake RX though. Yeah. And, you know it's one true. of us. Hasn't was, even played the freaking game. One of us doesn't even own the game, yeah. I, you know, I kind of feel like I missed out, but at the same time, I watched you play some of that speedrun, and I went, man, this game does not look like it's for me. Oh, yeah, I, I feel you. It's pretty It's pretty cool, though. It's a fun game. Yeah. Maybe it's also, three, it's also it. three bucks. Oh, really? It's also three bucks, which is insane, yeah. It's, I got Guilty Gear the other day, and I'm like, Guilty Gear seems pretty fun. I might play it a bit, but I'm, I'm, I'm getting the sneaking suspicion that I feel like I'm going to end up playing more of Snake RX in general than I am of Guilty Gear. So it's a lot of sneak make of that what you will. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, man. I I think that if when it was pitched to me, they told me it was three dollars, I would have been a lot more likely to buy it and play it for like two days at least, just for fun. Mm -hmm. But yeah. I thought it was like fifteen. The, the 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 guy is still like actively developing it though. He's like he's like doing updates every week and stuff, which is pretty cool. That's crazy for three dollars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh. Well. Um. Next week we'll do co-op Snake RX, I guess. That would be cool if there was like <laughs> one of us controlling the front and one of us controlled the back, and it was like <laughs> you don't even get to control the direction; you just kind of wiggle the tail of it. Yeah, I, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, or I'll, Wouldn't I'll do just anything. sit here. Fun. I'll just sit here and I'll watch you, and I'll say, "Hey, don't get hit a lot." Good plan. Good plan. All right, you ready to play Monster Train? Yeah, very nice. excited. My last three runs have been very uh, strange. So I played on uh, oh. two two days ago. I played Shadow Siege Infused Train Steward for, again. I heard that went terribly. Yeah, I heard I, that went terribly. And I, I, I heard about it because I had a Shadow Siege run recently. People told me that your run was awful in in yeah. the comments of my video. I missed killing the divinity by one thousand health. It oh, was, was pretty heart... close, though. Yeah, it was a heartbreaker. Um, and then, with melting, I did the infinite. Oh, yeah. you told me about that. Yeah. Like, hour two and, and a half hour run, or whatever, run. right? Mm -hmm. oh. so, you know, yeah, funnily sounds, enough, sounds great. 
doing an infinite to a point where Subsuming Blade will kill the divinity on turn two, not the longest piece of Monster Train content I've ever produced. Our, what is the longest? Our initial Stygian review is two hours and 12 minutes. That is oh, the longest yeah. thing I've ever put out. Yo, let, let's, 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 you know, block off a day. One mm. of these, one of these days, and let's just do a, a review of every single card in the game. Yeah, let's do a and review. It's like an 18 hour long video. Well, what if we did a review of all of our old reviews? That's a fucking nightmare. Yeah. Sit down and watch no. uh, eight hours of us talking about the cards and then make eight hours of us talking about us talking about the cards. Horrible. Sounds oh, by great. the way, as far as plugs go, she forgot to ask me mm -hmm. very rude of you. I, mean, I have no plugs, around. basically, because like, like I said, I'm, I'm going to be on vacation. So mm -hmm. uh, no no plugs. I got, I got some good videos. The Snake RX speedrun, if you want to see that, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, World record Snake RX speedrunner right here. Yeah, try, try to beat it. If you're, if you're interested in the game, I would love to see more than anything. I would love to see people try to try to beat the run because the more people who play it, the cooler it is that I have the speedrun world record. So And you, you know. get to push the boundaries, too. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, that too. Mm -hmm. But mostly just you gotta have more people to beat. Exactly. Okay. Anything else? Uh, this is the part where I would ask you if you have anything you'd like to plug, but you steamrolled over the flow of conversation. I thought I thought you usually do it before this part. I don't remember nah, anything. I usually do it right here, but it's okay. It doesn't matter. Okay. We you got a little this... checklist you're going through? No, nah, I just have done a lot of these videos, so I go through them in a specific order. We just talk more. Okay. These intros are about twice as long as a normal intro because there's two of us. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. All right. Are well, you ready? Um, yeah, let's go. How do you All feel right. about the start? Mm, we have Penumbra. So that's not great. Yeah. Could be worse. Could be Could be no architect. We'll find yeah. out soon. Yeah, it could, it could be worse. Yeah, that's fair. I don't feel... So... In terms of crazy, wacky stuff that we can do, I don't know if there's much, but I guess we'll see what the game shows us a little bit. Mm -hmm. I actually, you know, in the in the Shadow Seed Strain Steward run, I had I had the first run ever where I willingly clicked on Prism Retrieval. Because Train it, Stewards, did it help? no, because I drew it at the bottom after I draw my Train Stewards, oh. but it was basically a fourth copy of Train Steward. I just remember two things actually. Two things mm -hmm. I wanted to say. Okay. In in the comments of my video about your 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 Shadow Siege run, someone mentioned that um, you felt that uh, if you took an on draw priority unit and infused mm -hmm. it with a draw priority unit, it should then give that unit draw priority. Yes. I just wanted to say that I agree with you. Yeah. I think it would. I nice. I, I stand with Voix on this one. Crazy. That makes sense. It just be. Um, it, the, it, Adding draw yeah, priority good. units to your units is cool, and it would be nice if your runs didn't get punished for it. Yes. Uh, the second thing is someone mentioned in the comments of last co-op last mm -hmm. week mm -hmm. that in the in the in the beta for the DLC, a bog fly costs yeah. one. Yeah, which yeah, is, yeah, you're not losing your mind. That is correct. I did. I did see that. Thankfully, okay. I'm not. Just wanted to make sure in case you didn't read it. Yeah, you're not. You're not entirely crazy. Oh, yeah. Also, final warning: That's it good. is 5 p.m. and the birds are out in force, so beware. Aw, oh, watch out, windows. <laughs> we got the window open, so if he flies into the window, he might actually just fly right through the screen. Might get attacked yeah, that'd be by sick. a bird. That would that would not be sick. <laughs> that'd be a very good co-op episode. Yeah. Listen, well, <laughs> he want like the like, the bird wants to get in on that co-op episode. He's gonna fly in here and give his opinions. All right. Squawk. Squawk. We have uh, Plating Seal, Daedalus, Ragefell, Sap, Seraph, Immortal Trade, Crystallis, Prism Retrieval, We're Umbra, Exile, Stygian. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and then also go uh, go over to Cranberry's channel and say something to him, too. Uh, Lost Luggage is pretty good with Forgone Power, I feel like. I'm down. Yep. Yeah. Um, but what about Prism Retrieval with first Hell Pack? So wait, you're not saying anything. We could uh, could intrinsic and then pick up Cheater's Hand for the Prism Retrieval, and then and then what? Do like do Monstrous Penumbra instead? Get yeah. a get a big Monster Boy. We get plus fifteen. This sounds really bad. 
Yeah, I think lost luggage is better. Mm -hmm. I think it's worth considering not for the prison retrieval, but for the future. Like, yeah, Umbra has, I think, the best use of of first hell pack. Absolutely. Um, but lost luggage is just it's just it's just good value no yeah, matter very what. Good. And there's no guarantee we'll see those good X cost cards. So. Yeah, they are mostly rares. Uh, Architect, I believe. I like I like it here over. Uh, yeah. Over I like, of monsters. So monsters I, I, isn't oh, the worst here because we start that? with a mortal trade. What was that? Say one sec. Oh, it's kind of interesting too. That, mm -hmm. that, that, I didn't say one sec. Sorry. Oh, no. sorry. But yeah, I mean, I, I'd rather hello? just go architect here. Hello, is it? Is this a? This is a Discord problem. Yeah. yeah hello. Hi. Oh, we're getting a little bit of lag here. I think we are having some sort of minor Discord problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna pause the recording. Yeah. All right. Charter strikes again, but we're fixed. Yeah, so. we're, we're all good. Mm -hmm. Re repaired until the bird flies in. Maybe the bird was stealing my yeah. Wi-Fi. Could be. Uh, the, the bird's here to. Re the bird is here to reset your browser for, or your not your browser, your router for you. Reset my browser too. Yeah. Honestly, how, what, what, rough rough estimate of how many tabs you got right now? Uh, last time we it was asked, it was around forty four. So it's probably decreased since then. So it's probably around thirty seven. Really? Okay, that's fine. It's not so bad. Uh, okay, so I, I just want to go Architect for the simplicity of it all. I feel like Monstrous yes. is the worst stat line. Yeah, and I, I also just like the, the size increase too. Mm -hmm. Let's you do some fun stuff. I actually used that as an enabler for uh, Shadow Siege recently. Ah. We get two Stygian yeah, banners like, lined I, up I, I went like... Which makes me want to do Divine Boons here. Yeah, it makes sense. We can take the take the boon and uh, just roll incant and play play architect like on the incant floor, and yeah. that, that would be pretty good. It won't be a it won't be an idiot sandwich gone poggy mm -hmm. sort of situation, but like, what are you gonna do here? I don't know. So let's take it. Okay. Armor 10. I think because we took Boy, the pack Hello? Hello? Primary? Oh, uh, it's it's fucked up again. Is it really? Oh, I think I think it was maybe just a hiccup. I think I think we're good now. Hmm. Perhaps. Let me uh, yeah. is the is the an internet ridden issues? Let me I'll pause the recording and I'll check it again real quick. All right, hopefully hopefully all all internet issues fixed. And I think we should be good to go. Uh, hit it. Yeah, I think uh, I think we shouldn't take this trial armor. Maybe we might did be able to get away. Recording? Yeah, I did. Oh, you did? Okay, sorry. Yeah, yeah, no worries, no worries. Did not make um, that clear. Did you? Did you? You don't want to do the trial? It's like it's close. We'll take some damage for it, but actually, with frostbite, we can probably sneak past the boss. I, yeah, I think I think we'll be okay. And we have the Helix Crystals too. I think I think you know. Mm. Yeah, I, yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I agree. Absolutely fine. When has there ever been an issue? Right? Come on. I mean, this is a relatively soft combat. Like these enemies aren't that scary. Yeah. Where do you want to play here? I think I think I my I would say Shade Splitter first, Penumbra top floor, Helix Crystal bottom floor to, to soften mm -hmm. him, and then just go from there. Thinking about doing a prism retrieval for one, actually, to get a Oh, plus that could be kinda of fun. Yeah. I think that could it's be kinda of cool. Damage train steward. We have the room. Yeah, let's try it. Prism retrieval world first. Yeah. We still play Crystallis, though. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. We get a 10 damage. I think we still put him in front, because Penumbra's bigger numbers. Yes. And then you play the power down there to kill him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Top four. Sorry, I'm just of course, preparing. Of course, of course. Uh -huh, get into the habit. Get ready for yeah. it. Well, oh. Free money. That's always yeah. nice to see. Get him, train steward. Yeah, not, not, High not, roll on the foregone powers. Yeah, trial's looking good. 
Yeah, we, this is a like the trial would be scary if we had worse starting cards, but Crystallis is very good and four gun power is. Oh, hell yeah. We're okay. I don't think we want to play Immortal Trade. I feel another four gun power coming. Or not four gun power, mm -hmm. uh, other one. Yeah, alright. Was it Crystallis is the card that I feel coming? There it is. Either way. There it is. Not even a train steward dead. Trial taken, no damage. My combat easy. is really easy. Yeah. I've not really thought about it too much, but like that combat is extremely easy compared to some of the things you can see there. You also instantly punish for not taking the hell pack, by the way. Pris Prismal yeah, Dust right away. Yeah, Prismal Dust right away. You want to take perils? How do you feel about perils? How do you feel about good. perils? <laughs> yeah, I think it's good. Yeah, I, I'm down with. I am down mm -hmm. with it. It's uh, it's free and it encants. Yep, and we can do we can, we can make the run a little weird. Yeah. Although Ember Drain isn't really that weird, but you know. Crypt Builder. In I the grand scheme with. of things. Uh, we have we have foregone power, so we can mm -hmm. use that if like worst case scenario. So oh, yeah, seems good to me. Yeah, I think even if you have to pay three for this, the card is still pretty good. Especially in the early game, but yeah. Yeah. In general. And then there's a Siren. It's not my favorite Siren, but I think we can make Nameless Siren work here for sure. Yeah. We can play We can play mid floor, and then we don't have to even worry about uh, about it being, like, survivable. Mm -hmm. We can just, like, we can just use, we can use, like, uh, we can use a Penumbra as, like, an like a initial tank, and then we can pivot to, like, something else as the real tank uh, after the first couple of uh, rounds. Confirm left here. Just make sure. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No, yeah. Like, no crazy mer magic shot plan you want to pull. No. Not Endless. not at all. All right. Show us hot shark. Oh hot shark. Hot yeah. shark. Hot shark. Yes. Good. Love this game. Yeah. Great. Sometimes it is just that easy, huh? Yeah. I'm down to reroll this. I I am also down. We have we have yeah. the divine boon, so if we see mm -hmm. like a really good multi strike or whatever, we can just we can just take the boon and get it. Plus twenty five is good. Yeah. This shark is strong. And then quick is kind of interesting, but I think we don't want it. I don't yeah. think you want quick on the on the angry siren. In my opinion, for this siren, you want to give her multi strike, incant armor two, and then a defensive upgrade as your infusion. Like armor shark is good, or just mm. more health. Yeah, that's how I tend to play her. Uh, if we're if we're playing middle floor though, I think we can get by with just one of those two defensive options, either the the shark incant or the plus two incant. Um, because if we're playing mid floor, she's not getting swept every turn. Yeah. If you're getting swept every turn, then you want to maybe play top floor. Yeah. We can see what we see here. Uh, I like taking the money anyway here. Go to twenty. We're really strong. Like we're really, really strong. Uh, I don't know. I I would be more hesitant. Like, what's what's in the next ring? What do we have coming up? Steel shop. With us, Steel banner. shop and Stygian and banner. Mm -hmm. Okay, you know what? You've actually sold me. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm down with it then. I'm pretty sure that Endless Hot Shark solos this combat. Oh yeah, he crushes these guys. Oh yeah, we might we might have to wait till uh, the second wave, I guess, right? Because mm -hmm. if we don't see him first turn because of the uh, the siren, yeah, we'll have to play it late. But that's even that's fine. So we can still play it top floor and it'll one v one. And I am not afraid of the spikes here. Yeah. Yeah. Easy. Easy. If we get an opening draw, fine. I guess in theory the the haste boys if they're in, if they're infused could be issue, it could be an issue but like they're not yeah that's right true. now and then and the the sentry gets by okay cranberry which way would you play this would you play the shade splitter first or would you put the nameless siren down first I would play shade splitter first because we have perils ah but you lose an it you lose an incant you lose a incant whatever dude <laughs> just checking and then I play penumbra first anyway right. Get everyone mm. nice and heated. I think uh, ASAP removal of train stewards here. Oh, yeah. yeah. Although, this although it's, it, it's get, I'm telling you, 100% get in the collector right here with that steward. Oh, yeah. Ah, fuck. <laughs> I mean, oh, well. th with this steward, you mean, right? Yeah, that one. Exactly. Oh, no, we've thrown... We won't be able to put uh, the shark up top floor now. 
Could give him I life don't steal. we need to worry about it? No, I don't either. You can give him extreme amounts of life steal. <laughs> it's almost enough to. I mean, sure, why not? He's earned it. He has zero attack. I think it's four attack now, though. Oh, and he just dies first hit. Wait a minute. Think so we play. Oh, Chris you heal, did you heal his crystal? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think he. I think he survives and he attacks. Yeah, look at him go. Doesn't doesn't last very long, but. Now he's two HP away or two attack away. I mean, yeah. two more attack and this guy would have handled it. Oh. Yeah, this run is gonna turn out very strong. The only way that this run can find itself scared is if we miss multi strike. But I think that if we plan around that, we can still win. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think we skip this. What do you think? Okay. Um. Oh, hold on. Give me one second. You have to take over. I'll be back in a in a quick sec. Okay. I believe in you. Okay. Yeah. So basically, I took Anton. I've taken Anton Rosalt a few times as a card that you pick as. Just like a ping in a deck without any, and it just never ends up doing anything for me. The three damage is just not enough, and I feel like especially with Hot Shark it doesn't matter. So I'm gonna press skip here. And oh god. I don't feel right about this one. Uh I'm back, don't you dare skip that glacial seal. <laughs> Alright, I was, uh, didn't didn't feel right about pressing skip without at least letting you see the glacial seal. <laughs> Okay, yeah, you can skip it now. Like, okay, but what well, if Crystalline Seeds is okay? What if Glacial Seal isn't the worst take here? What do you want to do? Put it on Hot Shark? Put it, put it on Hot Shark. Yeah, sounds really bad. Really? No, that sounds really bad. So yeah, it hands. sounds really bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, all right. Crystalline I Seeds. I don't hate. I don't hate. I don't hate. Yeah, I don't hate seeds. This is a zero cost spell. Yeah, sure. Or Enchanting Baby. And it does maybe something. This card should have its Frostbite out, but like quadrupled. I feel like. Uh, right. Yeah, I, I agree, especially with the with the nerfs to Frostbite in general, with the Divinity. Yeah. I agree. Um, it's so sad. It definitely, definitely right path, mm -hmm. also, yeah. Archstone and Can Armor 2 and Shield Stone. Pretty good. Pretty good I would stuff like, in there. I'm down to just grab this Armor Shark and slap that bad boy right on Nameless Siren. Okay, we have... we uh, You know what? I, I think we can do that, too. Mm -hmm. We have the we have the incant stone in the shop as well, mm -hmm. which is pretty sweet. She's so we can we can do that and probably play top floor pretty safely. Yeah, it's gonna be very tanky. Yes. And then yeah, let's just click it. So we will want to pick up wherever it is. We'll want to duplicate and infuse on himself hot shark. So we're gonna we're gonna go through a lot of pack shards with unit infusions here, but that's okay. Put Incant Armor 2 on the Nameless Siren, and then we'll reroll for Multi Strike. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just making sure you don't want to try anything out of this world here. Nothing, nothing weird today. Normal, normal run. Normal, normal every day at the office run a monster train. Mm -hmm. Put him in now. I think it's fine. Have you had people ask you at all about trying to do uh, high shard count runs? Because I had a couple of people yes. ask me the other day. Yep, people ask uh, me And then I lot. did one, and it was it was a lot of fun. Mm. So the one. Have you have you have you have you successfully pulled off any like big ones? I did one where I had Imp Parade Queen. I did this on stream. I had Imp Parade Queen because the start was really bad, and I went, "Man, this is horrible. Man, this is horrible." We limped through Daedalus, and then I got Morsel Made and took like 200 pack shards in one. Ah, cool. Uh, I would like to make um, one Hot Shark here. Ah, uh, for the for the uh, the mm -hmm. infusing later. Yep. Um, I think I can agree to that. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing else. That makes sense. Very good yeah. Here. So I have and we'll just and we'll just we'll just frost by Daedalus to hell here, basically. Yeah, two two endless uh, plus twenty five hot sharks. They crush Daedalus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we'll infuse. We'll be at. 70 pack shards going into ring four at this rate, but I'm not afraid. Do you want to infuse the sharks here, or do you want to infuse the, uh... We already... Oh, did, uh... did you already do the infusion yeah, of the already, other one? Okay, yeah, sorry, sorry. Siren. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I bet you can't do one in this, or two in a single temple. 
would be kind of interesting. <laughs> you could like the, the, you could go first first temple you see, train steward on the train steward, train steward on the train steward. Go go go. Yeah, it would make uh make the dailies a lot more interesting because in the dailies, if you haven't played them, it's a lot of min maxing pack shards because pack shards in equal higher score. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you do a lot of like maximizing how many pack shards you take, and it's really weird. Like you to to top out on dailies, you mm -hmm. have to like take. Uh, to take extra units to infuse them later for more pack shards. It's oh, crazy. Oh, wow. That is, that's that's kind of cool. Yeah, it's fun. But it's also like, oh, I took too many and died. Whoops. I can see that being an issue as well. Go train stewards. Um, I shouldn't have played. Eh, one of them will just go top floor. That's fine. I don't really feel like we need to do a whole lot of min-maxing of this run. Right now, anyway. No. I, I agree. We'll just throw out the uh, spells and sit. The, uh, well, that hot shark's gonna fuck right now, dude. Look at him go. The, uh, well, the he's game... gonna get the, the, the morsel gets swept, so. Yeah. Oh. Misplay alert. Uh, yeah, miss. Uh, yeah. He's thrown. Look at that crystalline seeds. This We could play this like a weird. Uh, sort of. Like pseudo cold channel run, where we just sack a bunch of frostbite, but I think that dies to divinity. Hmm. Yeah. Weird, though. i play one of these first. Yeah. How does he get swept every time? Unbelievable. Bullshit. He should be so strong. Game's rigged against sharks. Sharksist. Sounds like a uh, very, very near to uh, USSR era economic policy. Yeah, I'm a, mm -hmm. I'm a Sharksist. Yes. Carl Dude. Sharks. Dude, Carl Sharks. That's great. My favorite political theorist. Yeah. Boys, you're, you're laughing now, but the Sharks are taking over our country. <laughs> the Sharks are taking over and you're laughing? It's the, it's the Joker? Anyone the Joker? I'm, I'm, I'm somewhat familiar. Mm -hmm. Uh... <laughs> Hey, it's there. Kindle, you should have taken hell back. Kindle, dude, come on. Like, what about Horfrost Effigy? What about it, Voix, huh? I don't know, Craig. What do you think about it here? We, we, got a lot of, we got a lot of Frostbite happening. We picked Crystalline Seeds. Yeah. Think about it. Uh, yeah, but here's the here's the real issue, Voix. We have we have a one card making Frostbite. His name is Shark. He's doing a great job, but he doesn't make a whole lot. He just makes a little bit on everyone, which yeah. which is what we what we what this, that's what we want. We don't want what that does. <laughs> yeah, it is actively detrimental to our run using Frostbite to take the Frostbite doubler. Sad. I'm, I'm, you know, again, I'm okay with zero cost uh, spells, which is what Kindle is. Yeah, I guess Kindle's fine. And then we just take double draw. If, if we get, if we get it on, the, if we get it on, if we get intrinsic on it. We have the uh, the lost luggage is actually pretty cool. Yeah, it's not bad. Trick. Yeah. Mm. I'm okay. I think there's a cool, cool button on the bottom of the screen you can press right now. Test, test it out. See what happens. Uh, oh, they went away. Yeah. You want to take draw here? Uh, I think so. Our champion but is. We may want to. We may want to. Yeah, he is space prison, so we don't need the light of Seraph mm -hmm. on this run. So yeah, I'm. I'm down with. I'm down with a uh, one card draw, and then if we don't see intrinsic, we maybe take Fel's Remorse for energy for that. Uh, that suitcase. Mm -hmm. But if we yeah. do see intrinsic, we probably just go double double card draw. Yeah. God, our champion on this run is really just an intrinsic space prism. What Hell happened? yeah, dude! What happened, Penumbra? You wanna go? 
Which way do you want to go? I here? think le I think I think left for removals is the most important thing. Still, you, you did you did the the cave dupe, so you wouldn't have to do it here. Uh -huh. But even here, if we don't have that much, it's worth like duping. Yeah, if we had a multi strike on the siren, we could just send it. But oh yeah, I think we're okay to just go left here. Let's do is it. there any like spell upgrades you really want from the 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 spell shop? Minus ones are. Not that I can think good. of really. Yeah, but they're not super important here. Yeah, let's just go left. Okay. And now. And you've said Moves. that once you're over 40, you just keep going, basically, right? At this point? Yeah, are we going over Are we going over here? We're going to do the, the, Titan, the Titan infusion, right? Well, yeah, we're already at 45, right? So we're already past the bad number, so we can just keep going. No, no, and the number's over. Sorry, the number's 50. Oh, it's say, the 50. number is 50 is the bad number. We could so, wait. uh... Yeah, well, let's let's take a quick peek at the uh, the map here. Oh, temple there. Yeah, we wait then. Yeah, we can hold. We're we're at a very good spot here to to not to not do it. Is it the glutton? No. No. Okay. Absolutely not. I'm so really um, not. How do you feel about duplicating? Nothing. I don't really want to duplicate any of this. Uh, you might not like this. I actually know. I we probably want to duplicate. I don't even know. Actually, this helix is gonna start falling off soon too. Mm -hmm. We could do crystalline seeds. What I if guess. we do? What if we? Yeah. What if we duplicated the crystalline seeds? Or what if we did kindle? Right. All we need is this. Oh, voix, kindle, kindle, prismatic, uh, retrieval, whatever it's called, prism <laughs> retrieval. All right. You know you gotta. You know you gotta do it now. We wanted to be weird. This isn't. This isn't weird in a way that wins, though. This just sucks. You didn't even look yeah. at the temple? Or yeah, did you look at it? I don't remember what was in we, there. If we, if in there. If we don't want to go past 50, we can't take anything. It was like value stone. No, I know, but maybe maybe there's like... Value stone and what else? This is a, I think it was a purge stone, but I'm not sure. Oh, tr trash. Okay, good. Even if it was intrinsic, I don't think we want to go over 54 intrinsic Kindle. Uh, I think it would maybe, maybe we, we would have been fine here because we didn't get Party Boy, but mm -hmm. um, I don't know. You want to take this trial? Six attack. Afraid. I'm also not afraid. I think I think the shark picks off all the backliners for us, and mm -hmm. then it's just like it's just like one guy that the the siren should be able to handle. Yeah. Oh, twenty one times two. That's a big number. You I'm fool, Kindle! Misplay alert, misplay alert. Although it's actually not even really that much of a misplay because you can yeah. just uh, play still... all your units and then you still play Kindle. Yeah. But for a second it wasn't going to give me the energy and I was going to go, hey, wait, what? We're good. Full hand cost zero. Alright, this time we Kindle first. No longer. So we're gonna rotate this shark to top four, I think. That makes but, sense. Yeah, we wanna tank for the siren here. It's gonna be a little important, not super important, but it's a little important to leave a space on the floor to drop a morsel, I feel like. So we can tank the ember drain with the morsels. And still get the incant. Okay. Sounds good. Do you know Crystallis would kill here? I think that's kind of surprising. That the that the armor gains happens after the damage? Yeah. Uh, you know, honestly, if you had asked me, I wouldn't have known which... I, I, isn't it kind of weird how there's like still things that you don't know how it works in this game? Yeah. After all this time? I think it is a little strange. I, 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 I found out a new thing actually the other day. Oh, oh, yeah. Although it sounds like you found out something new as well. What's that? Well, what did you, you sound like you were going to have a new thing first. What's your new thing? No, I, my new thing was just I'm going to move Shark to bottom floor here because we have damage oh. shield. Okay. You can go on. Um, my, my new thing I learned was that uh, Morsels retain stat buffs when retched. So oh, really? if, you have, if you have Primordium and you let's say you, you Razor Sharp Edge Primordium and then you, you retch it, mm -hmm. it keeps that Razor Sharp Edge buff, which I didn't ah. realize. Huh. Yeah, I don't know why it, it, it makes sense, right? Someone yeah. was like, "You should. Why don't you know this? Like, when units die, they keep stat buffs. Why would morsels be different?" And I was like, "I don't know. I just never thought of it." Come on, Kramer. I had never in my head. Idiot. I, yeah, I had never in my head like like thought like 
what happens when you when you eat morsels? What happens to their stats? <laughs> I, I, you know. When you eat morsels, but it does make what sense. happens? Well, what did that happen here, dude? Yeah. This guy goes on. It's okay. He's too smart. Oh well. Yeah. Oh well. No biggie. Yo, voice, you have so many curses. Be careful, dude. Oh no. Should have actually looked to make sure we weren't taking damage up there. But. You know. This boss feels so weird in comparison to, like, the other two bosses. Oh. Slay out of self mutilation just uh, feels like such a non effect. I mean, Porcupine is just like nothing. It's just like, hey, I kind of <laughs> am thicker. Like, I don't know. Yeah, Porcupine's just a stat line. Crowd mm -hmm. Spike. They, you are kind of joking about it, I think, but it's not like the worst thing ever. I don't like it. What are we going to do with us? What, what, I, I, like, I don't like it either. We could, but. We have Shade Splitters, right? It is just like, hey, maybe we maybe we spike Zodia because we have fucking two Kindles in this deck. Yeah, maybe we get really lucky, but realistically, it's just gonna do nothing. Yeah. yeah. I don't hate Grovel for the fact that it's a, it's a damage shield. Yeah, it does give damage shield, which isn't bad, but it costs two, which is bad. We can just skip then. Yeah, I don't think it's right. I mean, it's. Mm -hmm. We get two morsels to chump block with, too. It's a lot of defensive possibilities. Do you think we're scared, scared from a defensive standpoint, though? Because I don't really feel like we are. No, I don't think so either. You took, you took, we, we got the, we got the, uh, the incant stone and then also the shark infusion, like, mm -hmm. which is very strong. We, we should be fine. We should be fine. Okay. Uh, um, eh. hmm. like, urgent spines hmm. is okay, right? I, again, zero cost spells. Mm hmm. That's something too with Crystallis potentially. I'm done. Yeah. Okay. You could take Guardian Stone there, but Guardian Stone doesn't feel great. Wanna go right? Y yeah. Yeah. Heal back the health we lost. Come on, multi strike. There we go. We will not be. No, it is just today. that easy. Yeah. So, I'm gonna do Shark here. Intrinsic spell chain. My favorite uh, magic set, Cons of Shark here. Yeah. How do you even know about fucking Cons of Tark here, dude? You weren't, I don't think you were playing magic when that set came out. I don't know. It's one of those names that I've heard and I like, that's a good name. Cons of Tark here, I like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, buddy. Well, it's not amazing, but it's not terrible either. Like, I don't know. I think Boone and the Blacksmith might be better. I don't know. Let's give him more health. Do, 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 you, do, you think we're, do you think we're going to leak it all from this point on? Maybe. I don't think here's, so, really, honestly. Okay. But here's my here's my follow-up. You want Penumbra to die. Yeah. Yeah. Is it actually mm -hmm. worse for Penumbra to be alive? Well, what do we what do we put there in the spot then, right? Shark. Like, when Penumbra dies, what do we do with that extra space now? Shark moves in. We, we could... Doesn't Shark already have enough room to move in, basically? We're going to make a second Siren. Yeah, but even with the second Siren, because it's, fi it's five space, right? Mm -hmm. you hear me? It's five space initially. Mm -hmm. We have the Architect number there, which is net one. So it's six space. Siren, Siren, Shark. Yeah, all right. I guess he got me. Yeah. Well, so we, we, we had nothing to do with that. With that yeah, but if we're playing against Divinity and we're playing top floor, I assume the morsels get swept. All right. <laughs> Fine, we can okay. help Penumbra. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's uh, we can either take fifteen. Here. So we're getting fifteen from duplicating the siren. So we have fifteen okay. shards to take. I feel like it's best just to grab this relic. I don't hate the intrinsic on the the Kindle though, with with uh, luggage. I don't know, it gives us a weird number, so because we don't get uh, we get 105 then, and I really don't like going past 100. Do you think do you think the the sweep doing one more is going to be a huge deal for us? I think it matters. Like, is it is intrinsic so good that you want to give Divinity plus one sweep? 
I don't know, because we get to we get to play a lot of cards on that opening turn. Yeah, but our cards are just like they're not very good. That's true. They do kind of suck. We're playing like we're taking this and making the divinity stronger to play like three more shade splitters, maybe. And That's a lot fair. of our deck is okay. free. You have, you have convinced me, Voyix. Yeah, I feel like we're best just to take the relic. Maybe we get double encant. Oh, that'd be that'd be nice. And also, uh, I feel like A, we want to take some removals, but B, I don't think it matters as well. I think that this is the sort of position where uh, we're going to win almost no matter what. Yeah, we're, we're pretty set here, I feel like. Mm -hmm. I'm going to cut two train stewards now. I, I approve of this message. Be gone, big stew. Despite having taken a lot of cards, we're at 26. I guess we've just taken a lot of removals as well. Mm -hmm. Alright. This is a kick your feet up and relax sort of run. I... I think Heaven Seal is fine. Yeah, I feel pretty safe. There's maybe like one trouble wave though. Mm -hmm. But even if that wave leaks, we'll still be fine. It's the second wave can be scary if the tank is infused, but... Let's just not have that happen. Although it's 70 pack shards. You think, you know? Yeah, let's go for it. Let's let's play over aggressive and die for fun. How's that sound? Sounds good. I think that this is a position where I've been being very cautious lately with and like if Oh my. <laughs> but I've been I've been playing it like if there's a single way that we could potentially die, I just avoid. Mm -hmm. Let me use Prism Retrieval to pull the shark for one, right? Sounds good. We yeah. can do Shade Splitter, Siren, Penumbra, Prism Retrieval for one. That math checks out. Okay. I'm going to start putting Penumbra. We should have put Intrinsic on Prism Retrieval. We're idiots, Hoyix. Oh. Sounds awful. Yeah, not not great, but you know. They put, put in, not terrible put either. On, put on Prism Retrieval so that Prism Retrieval can start drawing. Uh, with both units on turn one. Uh, disrespect and use the urchin spines for rage here. Ah, that, that's what it's that's that's what it's for. We can use it to potentially that. soften up this wave. Nah. That wave that wave that wave sucks, Voyx. Yeah, you're right. This wave, whack. I'm going to. Mm, what do you think here? You think you play Crystallis down here and keep the shark alive? That's a good question. You can you can play Crystallis and then play a mortal trait if you're a maniac to give him a little bit more health. As he's dying next turn for sure. No, oh, yeah, but like he he might take like a couple hits instead of just one hit. Uh, I see what you're saying. I don't think we need to worry about it that much because if he dies, we just replay him. Yeah. Before. I, I don't hate it though. I, I think I think softening that heavy is going to be like the or that that heavy is our highest chance for taking damage this run. So I think it's okay to weaken him. I agree. Because this wave should not be a problem. It's a good wave to die. Yeah. Get all this energy. Get it off. Yep. What do we do with it? And you passed on Shroud Spike. Unbelievable. Oh, also Shark doesn't kill this one. That's okay. You know what does kill it, though? Crystal. Helix Crystal. Yeah. Yeah. Does it look to you like the tank is stealth based on this animation? Mm. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say I could understand it, but I would not think so at an initial glance. My initial glance, I was like, it, oh it's... god, is that guy stealth too? He is not. A little worried. We're not incanting a crazy amount each turn, I feel like. We're incanting an okay amount. Three to I four. think we'll incant more. Yeah, we're like, we're fine, right? We have like two 200 damage yeah. sirens. That's probably plenty. Probably. Definitely. Definitely? Alright, definitely. I'll show your confidence. Easy. Easy. This is the easiest game of all time. Nice. 
the animations in this game feel so fast after playing Rogue Book. Oh my god, yeah, it's so yeah, nice. It mm -hmm. Being able to right click, oh, how lovely. You've been playing a little I, I don't know if this happened to you a lot. No, go on. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's that? Go on, go on. No, you, you, you first, you first. What were you saying? I was just saying you've been playing a lot of Rogue Book, right? Yeah, yeah, a decent amount. Not, not a ton, but a, a bit. Mm -hmm. I've been playing it a little bit, and it's been fun. Um, I think you can just skip this, dude. Yeah. And... Um, oh, I like Drain a lot here, kind of. I also awkward. like Drain here a lot, too. Yeah, it's good. It's awkward because it discards and, you... like, hurts a little bit, but I think it's good. I think I think putting that on the, uh, the sweep attack on Divinity is going to be pretty good. Yeah, I agree. So I'm down with it. Um, oh shit, I forgot what my question was now though. Shit. Uh, I'm gonna go left here. Oh yeah. yeah. Alright. Dig deep in the brain power. What was the question? I can't. I can't. No. It's it's gone. It's gone forever. And maybe you'll remember it like three days from now. No, no, it's done. It's, it's never coming back. Oh uh, we can we can edit it in. What do you mean we can edit it in? You uh, you remember that your doesn't question. doesn't exist. You remember your question three no. days from now, and then we record you asking it, and I put it in right here where we're going, and we'll be just be quiet for 30 seconds right now. Don't well, actually. No. It's, it's not worth it. <laughs> I want to get rid of foregone power times two. Um. Yeah, sure. Okay. Fine. Yeah. You want to put a plus 20 and consume on the uh, hammer? On the hammer? Oh, that hammer. Crypt, crypt builder? Yeah, sure. Is that a hammer? Yes, I guess fine. it is. Yeah, it's definitely a hammer, dude. What do you thought it was this whole time? I don't know. I didn't really think about it, to be honest. Wow. <laughs> Learning never, something new every day. I've never thought about what is Crypt Builder. Wait, wait till this guy sees Titan Tooth. That a uh, wait a minute. That's a spear, isn't it? Tooth. It's a tooth. It's not a tooth. It's got a tooth in the name. Ooh, conscription notice. What do you want to do with conscription notice? I don't know. I just I just think it's neat. I want it. Let's take Pyrewall. Yes, there you go. Good. <laughs> Correct we choice. We never get to do anything fun anymore. You want to do minus one hole over drain here? It's pretty solid. Yeah. I don't see why not, really. I like it a lot. And then we just Could Cyrus on the Helix Crystal, which I think is also pretty good here before you go. You think? Yeah, sure. Like what? Yeah, like what do you want? Do you, do you really want to keep playing the Helix Crystals after our first cycle through? They're okay. Too expensive. Exception. We got an incant. Yeah, you're right. All right, so. We'll duplicate Sire. I, rem I remember the question. I, I remember the question. It. Shut up, Voyx. I remember the question. All right, I'll edit this uh, in. So we're, we're talk we were talking we were talking about the right click thing before, right? And how it was good to have right clicks in this game. Uh huh. Uh, I don't know about you, but when I was playing Griftlands, I kept. Uh, right clicking, which does do something in that game a little bit. I don't know if you noticed, but it does make things go a little faster. Mm -hmm. But then I also kept accidentally like pulling up people's like bios by mistake oh. when I kept doing it. Did that happen to you at all? That was the question. I wanted to ask if you had that same experience. I did not have that same experience because I was going very slow with Grip Flames. I see. I mean, okay. uh, especially in negotiations, I had to take it very, very slowly. I see. I played that first Thank turn. Thank God I remember. I would, I, would, I would have lost my fucking mind if I didn't remember that dude. While you were talking, I played that first turn in the worst possible order. I don't think it matters, though, so cool. Yeah. Just to give the people something to get excited about. Here, we'll play Kindle last here. Actually, we won't play Kindle last <laughs> here because of the drain. You're a coward. I am a coward, you're right. You are correct. Yeah. 
I just gotta check. It's, I told my friend I'd be ready to go to the gym at 6-ish. And it's coming up on 6-ish, but we had a few hits in the recording. So I'm gonna be a little mm -hmm. longer. You gotta let him know you're gonna be a little late? Nah, he hasn't messaged me yet. He'll message me and then I'll say, hey, I'm gonna be late. Okay. He won't mind. He's just gonna, like, do cardio anyway while he waits. He spends a lot of time gotcha. at the gym. He's like a two to three hours a day type. And I'm like, yo, what? Wow. That's intense. Yeah, okay, we're we're encanting a lot more now. Do you want to take draw here or energy? Mm. I think we're safe to take a, a draw. I agree. I'm pretty sure. We've done a good, pretty good job of reducing the cost of spells as well here, so yeah. I think we take a draw and not worry about it too much. I am in agreement. Oh. Oh well. How can this be? Get these Forgone Powers out of here, dude. Yeah, well, I think Forgone Power is a card that the less of you have is better, but like you don't want to go to zero because it is free at a certain point. Not going to about. Two I think we want to go to zero with this deck because we have we have Drain. You're right. Card's dead. Then. <laughs> See. <laughs> uh, we can throw some drains at the lady here. Dude, she does post DLC foul, does a much more damage than pre DLC Seraph did. The monster. Hell yeah, dude. Absolute menace. Forty-five damage. What the heck? At least we got jack strips to soften her up, right? Oh, you know what I just remembered about? What? It's not a it's not a good bit from it, but you remember the bit and I think you should leave with the with the guy he's choking on the food and he's like, what's going on out there? Uh, no, I don't think so. You don't, you don't remember that bit? The guy's like choking on the food and he's like he's like what's what's going on out there? Oh yeah, it's, and it's like it's a, a yeah. celebrity coming in, right? Yeah, so the celebrity is at their table and he like doesn't want to embarrass himself, but he starts choking on food, so he has to right, think that he's right, not choking. Right, right, Yeah, I remember. Um, this. Do you want to take furnace tap, by the way? Not really. Coward. Two. It, like also. Yeah, but we, like we also incant less for the next four turns. We have we have perils in this deck though somewhere, right? Still one. Has this run? One perils. This guy put hold over on the perils and we're good. No. <laughs> what if we don't see it? Boy, X, you got it. You gotta do it, Voyx. You gotta do it. You gotta do it. I don't like Furnace Tap. You gotta do it. You put it on the Siren. Is put it on the Shark. <laughs> put it on the Shark? No, they took the Rage away from it. You can't do that anymore. Oh, oh man. I would skip this for sure. Voyx? Contractually obligated. Thank you. Fine. Um, so the reason why I was bringing that up, though, is that I remember I, I've been thinking about I think you should leave a lot lately because I'm going to force all of my friends at the beach this weekend on my vacation to watch the entire uh, first season. Mm -hmm. I'm very excited. That'll be fun. I will be. It'll be very good. I'm going to delay the or siren. Or terrible. Yeah. What's that? I think we want to delay the siren. Oh, we got to find that holdover for the perils. I'm in agreement. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> no. I'm gonna get rid of okay, one get some... foregone power. Yeah, definitely, two. definitely, I think two of them. Yeah. yeah. I think you should leave this. Come on. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, remove consume. That's how we we do this one. Remove consume on the uh, furnace tab, dude. No. <laughs> this sounds so tough. What do... Listen, Voix, the run's already the, the run from this point on is already over. We win, no matter what we do here. I think we can. Don't you want? Don't you want to go out with style? I think we can How are you gonna lose? lose? We're doing this. Come on, would I ever? Would I ever lead you astray? All right, fine. And we just get hold over here, and it works. Hey, wait a minute. Shit. Make this crystallis cost one. Seems good to me. Yeah, we got we got another magic shop coming up, so don't you worry. Yep, yep, yep. Do not fear. I'll give you a health for an artifact here. Yeah, I definitely give him some some HPs. 
Sure. No, this is bad. This yeah. is really bad. No, it's good. A hot shark. It's not good on shark, but we'll always have. Oh, I I forgot the the, the next turn. Yeah. yeah. If we if we don't if we don't if we don't uh see, uh if, if we if we don't have another unit to play, we'll put the damage shield on Titan Sentry, and that's bad because then we don't get revenge. Yep. And yeah. We should skip. Take the money. Give me the dollars. All right, cranberry. Improvise. Yep. I need to take a drink of water. Okay. Um. Let's see. We'll take architect first off, right off the bat. Um. And then. My my character for this scene will be a, uh, a diver who works at SeaWorld, and you will be the dolphin. Uh, 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 <laughs> Cran Cranberry, considering your history with dolphins, I am now concerned. You said you said to improvise. We're doing improv. Okay. Uh, what are my lines? E e e. Can you do a dolphin noise? Absolutely not. Do you think this this tone of voice goes up high enough to do a dolphin noise? I had a friend who was like, man, I wish I could make dolphin noises, and then he just fucking did it. And he was like, oh my god, I can do a dolphin noise. Uh, but I can't, I can't, I can't. Like, I... That's the best I can get. That was pretty good. Not that good. I want to skip this trial. You want to switch? Do you want, do you want, well, we, we can skip the trial, but do you want to be the, the trainer and I'll be the dolphin then? Uh. <laughs> hey, Mary, I think we can end the scene. <laughs> scene. And scene. Great work, everyone. Wrap it up. Put that in production. Yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I find bit. it weird that I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if you know this, but people who do improv they call like doing improv playing. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's kind of strange. I just find that to be interesting. Yeah. The oh, dead. I'm trying my best to get to play shark bottom floor here because he has more time for the poison to take hold. Misplay or misplay or. You're doing great. Don't worry. <laughs> Dude, the one time you set off the misplay alert alarm and it haunts me to this day. <laughs> People still say misplay <laughs> alert. To me. I'm sorry. It's okay. I mean, I perpetuated it. Jack strips. I had a run recently where I said, okay. Why did we get, why, why did we get jack strips? Excuse me, hold on. When did we get jack strips? Uh, it was the relic reward from ring five. I don't believe you. You're fucking lying to me. Okay, I mean. I was, I trying even... to was, I, was I trying to remember the, the question? Is that why I didn't yeah, notice? You were. Okay. It's also not very noteworthy. However, I had a run recently where I said, okay, let's take jack strips and see if it does something. And then on that run, I was going to die to the spikes enemy killing my backliner, but I had hold over drip fall and I just drip fall jack strips the spikes enemy to death. That's fantastic. Yeah, and I went, oh my god, jack strips did something. Mm -hmm. Believe it. I had a I had a run one time where I had I had drop I had drop cage and I forgot that uh, I had it, so <laughs> I was drip following the uh, one of the the two forty harvest guys. Mm -hmm. The ones that like harvest everyone for 15 armor. Yeah. I just kept dripping sense. him out of the floor so he wouldn't give everyone the the armor buff. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh man, he's gonna fucking kill my pyre. I can't I can't let him go. Uh... And I looked and I was like, he's got 25 days. What am I talking <laughs> about? He can go. Yeah, he, he can go. It's fine. It's no big deal. He can leave. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... That was fun. Yeah. Uh... I think we can kill you. I'm, just, I'm looking if we can get a number to hit the gilded wing here. I think we can't. So this guy's gonna hit us for a bit. I would start draining him now then. Yeah. Not Actually, about like literally right now, but like, yeah. Yeah. I think we can get there if we play Furnace Tap. Ah, you fool. But if we play Furnace Tap, oh, we didn't draw here. Furnace Tap. <laughs> okay, he dies just barely to the Frostbite. Cool. Yeah, cool. 
Also, if we play Furnace Hat, then we don't get to replay Shark, and Shark is my best friend, and I won't let him go. Okay. He's very important. Look at this furnace tap pop off. Listen. I'm listening. All we gotta do, uh -huh. all we gotta do, did you just, well, first of all, did you just sap uh, the the uh, morsel there? Yeah, for the intent. Yeah, I know, but you could just put it on him. On the boss? Whatever. Any yeah, On the boss. Anyway. It wasn't on the floor. It doesn't matter. Yeah, but you can still just give him sap. Ah, he's just gonna eat it up hitting Hot Shark. I think he still killed Hot Shark in like two hits. He would have had some for the top floor. I think. He would have had one set. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're right. You're you. right. All right, I'm gonna skip this. Um, yeah. One, two, three. Yeah, wow. Three, one, two. The Guardian Sandalet is not bad here. I we like got it. rid of most of our Foregone powers, though. We have a holdover discard. How, how do... Oh, we do. You're right. Okay. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. It's fine. I'm down with it. I like that card a lot more lately. So he's got to find holdover here, and then I'll look like a genius, okay? Mm-hmm. Shut up. I'm not. I didn't say a word. No, nah, shut up. Check the, check trinket, the trinket shop, shop first. Check, it, check the trinket shop. Mm -hmm. I want to reroll just in case there's double incant hiding in here. Okay, sounds good. Commemorative spot. What about sketches, though? <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. Let's mm -hmm, check. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's weird. Ah! <laughs> Lower the cost of, I guess, uh, I don't even know what. Furnace tap, humor me. <laughs> It'll be good. You gotta trust me, dude. I'm trusting. I have not not trusted at any point. Let me get rid of. I mean, honestly, the card. Honestly, to get rid I, of I, is... I, really... I think foregone power and immortal trade. <laughs> it's furnace tap, dude. Is the worst card in this deck by a lot. Fuck no. Hey, you know what? Fine, boys. Get rid of it. Nah, we just put a minus. Get rid one of on it. it. I will not. Have fun. Have fun finding a bird. For next week's co-op, then I guess. <laughs> next week you should be a bird, like someone who played a bird. Like the guy who's inside of Big Bird's costume. Yeah, on yeah. Or, Street, oh, or you could be Larry Bird. Or I could be Michael Keaton who played Birdman. Ooh. Any, uh, any other birds? Who can Sam? Okay. That's a bird. Yeah. How do you feel about Lucky Charms? All right. I Favorite. Really, you hate them. Hate them. Why is that? I don't get it. I don't what? get it. What, what don't you get? The marshmallows taste like shit. <laughs> I like marshmallows, but the marshmallows and Lucky Charms taste like shit. I don't get it. I don't get why everyone's like, yo, they're so good. They're not. They're bad. They're uh, they're magically delicious, I hear. No, they're not. They're not good. They're uh, mid-tier. Nah. It's F like... F tier. The marshmallows are okay. I don't think they're, like, insane, but they're fine. And... Listen, mar par Parmesan, not a real cheese. Marshmallows mm -hmm. and Lucky Charms, not real marshmallows. I mean, that's just... I, that one I will not argue on. I am sure that those are, like, nothing close to marshmallow. But I don't think they're necessarily... I don't think they're necessarily bad. I just... The rest of the cereal is not good. Do you think... Like, I, I have done it back and forth, and I really am not sure. Do you think it's better to put the sirens in front or behind Penumbra? I think it's better to put them behind. Okay. They, they, they scale I a bunch think, of health, I think they will, I think they will... Yeah, but they'll also scale a lot of damage. Yeah. To the, to the point to the point where they're, they, they're still more important, I think, to have behind. Okay. I'm with it. Want to play that furnace step? No, not real. <laughs> Wanna play, Wanna play that furnace tap? No? Okay. Wow, look at all these Ember Drain cards in my hand. They're really good. I love Ember Drain. Oh wait, I can't play them. Only we if only we had holdover. Yeah, we put it on the drain though. I think we put holdover on the perils. Tell me. Tell me why. 
I mean, we didn't we didn't we didn't know what was gonna happen. We could we couldn't have known. Why, cranberry? Why didn't we know? There was there was no way. To, there was no way. Why didn't we read? You can't. See it ahead you can't of time? blame. You can't. You can't. You can't blame yourself for this. Yeah, but the YouTube comments can. It's a really good miss because we want to throw this crypt builder here. Mm. Yep. Plus twenty consume. Not too bad. We get a big burst and then it's gone by the time they've encanted up and it doesn't matter anymore. I like it. Yep. Sorry, I didn't right click. I was looking away. We will die here if we must. Hey, why are you doing seven times two? Can I get a bigger number, please? That's half a little scary, I guess. Yeah, but we'll 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 outscale him. Yeah, I'm not afraid of putting these down. These more cells. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the uh, the interesting thing is. The the sirens when they have rage and sap on them, which they will, their numbers just don't change. Well, they change when they get more sap applied, but like they don't, their sap basically or their rage basically doesn't decay. Yeah. Strange. But cool. And you want to play this furnace tap? <sighs> Bring in the bird. <laughs> <laughs> Call him in. Special guest, the bird. Should be right clicking. We'll be okay because we have the hot shark doing the the heavy lift in here. We can play all of this, right? Yep. Yeah, we can play all of this. We can in fact play it all. And that's a big spike. In uh this this has enough that I'm just gonna click up to Super Ultra because there's enough incanting happening that it's just like please the animations. I beg you. He doesn't die. What the heck? Only we had furnace Maybe, tapped. Yeah. yeah, that's your fault. You can just yeah. play. The, you can play the shark top floor probably. Yeah, that's what be I'm okay thinking. From here. Yeah. We'll throw him down and he'll die in like a few turns. You're scary. This guy's scary. You, you can start sapping him preemptively if you want. Yeah, I think it's fine. Probably smart too. Because he's not going to die from the frostbite, because Shark is going to die at an awkward number. Oh, actually, Seraph, with the sick assist, dropped a Light Wings for us. Never mind. Thank you. Thank you, yeah, thank you, Seraph. Seraph was on our team the whole time. 15, 25. If I play the life steal on him... No, he, has, he isn't doing zero attack still. Oh, also, he wouldn't zero, go first. Zero attack damage. Yeah. Don't worry. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, misplay alert. No. Misplay. Ah, don't throw the sap up here. Ten armor. Fifteen armor. Who is this guy? Bro, I'm for content. Are you going to play the shark top again? Eight. Yeah, I think so. It's just like, does he die? Like once, you into, once you get into relentless, once you get into relentless, you're fine. So it's like, yeah, I know. guess we have plenty of a, of uh, health on the sirens. Mm -hmm. I guess we just don't play him. Yeah, I think you just pass it. It'd be fine. No, nah, I'm not afraid of this guy. Wow, no fear. I play, play two of them. I'm not afraid. Finally, a time to play Furnace Tap. Shut up! I guess we'll do this. <laughs> Rat bastard. <laughs> Not my fault. I trusted. I'm still trusting. He's about to pop off. Wow, that's exactly so. And finally, furnace tap. Look at that. You were right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill you. Look at how good it was. 
Wow, we You're never gonna work in this town again. <laughs> My improv career as the dolphin is gonna come to a close. <laughs> e Yeah, my friend messaged me. I gotta, I gotta type a message real quick. I'll let you uh, yeah. analyze the combat start. Yeah, no problem, no problem. Okay, so this oh. is the, the, oh, yeah, the, yeah, the start yeah, of the yeah, combat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's it. Okay. I think we're going to play Top Four. Prism Retrieval absolutely goes yeah. Pog here. Out of this world. I think we slap shark down here, bottom floor. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah. I mean, you could play. It doesn't matter either way. Mm -hmm. So yeah, you could play it mid floor. I guess playing I... mid floor means it gets it gets it gets hit one extra time. Yeah, that's true. I'm gonna hold this. I was just gonna brainlessly play that, but we should. Mm -hmm. Morsel, go. And I'm gonna go. And we. Beef up the old morsel. You think actually maybe we should have prison retreat? We should have prison retrieval first, huh? Two two incant missed. Ah, uh, yeah. Alert. Oh well, no big deal. We we may as well take the incants. The numbers aren't the same anymore. The numbers, Wait. Mason. What do they mean? I wonder our penumbra's just gonna die, isn't it? Yeah, he's not long for this world. Cut that out, I don't want to hold it. You know what, Penumbra? You did a great job. Mm -hmm. uh, these guys die naturally. I think we just have to incant, right? It's a bit of a race to get the yeah. sirens off the ground, so we just send it. I agree. Oh, actually, Penumbra maybe can live once we draw in the sap. I mean, the wave is still kick his, kick his teeth in, though. He's a big boy. He can handle it. Mm, wait a minute. Oh, I'll give him furnace tap. That'll help. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna throw a shark mid floor to catch these guys, I guess. Sounds good. It's a little awkward because of the way that this wave dies front to back. We won't kill spikes, but... Yeah, we'll see. We could actually give two Ember Drain to keep Penumbra alive if you wanted to. I don't think it's a terrible idea. Yeah. We're hurting our incants over the next few turns, but like the rest of our cards cost zero or three, so I don't feel like we're losing too much to keep Penumbra standing. Yeah, and then also we should play Furnace Tap too on him, just because you know it really helped him out. I feel like. <laughs> oh, we might be able to get away with it. Actually, most of the deck is free. I'm down to put Furnace Sap down here, actually. I think we want to put it on the back Siren, though. Yeah, we, that that would be better, but yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, well, you know what? Furnace Tap finally gets its time. It oh, happens. wait, we don't get to replay Shark now. That's right. Oh, no. I knew there was a reason we weren't doing that. Oh, well. Ah, fuck Shark. We don't need him anymore. Ah, what are you talking about? Look at this wave. It's fine. I don't think it's fine. Keep the divinity at zero, and then we'll sap something next turn. Uh, Penumbra dies here for sure. Very dead. Nah, he's gonna live forever, dude. He's gonna live forever. Shush. All right, so we're gonna play Crystallis. Okay. Oh, hey, Penumbra lives. Wow, we told you. Um, we can we can play Perils. Maybe letting him die would have been better because we could have perils him and yeah. then play the rest of the cards this turn. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that we want to just hold and play shark next turn. You should probably still play the drain, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Drain. That's pretty nice. We got the, we got the fire armor to tank this a bit. Yeah. I mean, it hurt a lot. But Shark makes How us triumphant. I was doing top four against the... Uh, oh, man. Mm -hmm. you know, the, the, the mini boss dude. Yeah. We're going to need to drain. That's an issue. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I guess we just put Shark up here to apply some Frostbite as well. I think so, yeah. We just drain the mini boss and hope for the best. Yeah. There goes Furnace Tap. Hey, I, I, it might actually like, like save. It might be like the damage we needed or whatever. I don't know. Although I think I think messing up the shark is a you know not. Yeah, worth. a little. It's a, it is a little bit of an unfortunate one that it messed up the shark. I should have probably played one of these. I'm trying to race the incants, but I probably should have played one of these. Mm -hmm. It's okay, we have a good hit here no matter what on the drain. Yeah. Yeah. I think we have found the losing line though. Yeah, we are very dead. I guess we have to furnace tap. Go, you wanna go back you wanna go back and replay it and not do the furnace tap? Uh in a minute. Is he, why is it only six? Oh, because of the armor. Yeah. So. 32. Can we do. Maybe if we just furnace tap again, we can get out of this? I don't think so. Keep furnace no, tapping the problem away? The Will Wings detonates top floor and we lose. Yeah, yeah. We just barely miss it. Okay. We can try it yeah. again, but we don't play furnace tap this time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Trust. Uh, Cranberry, I am I am starting the my faith is a little <laughs> shaken, I gotta be honest with you. Oh we can we can replay this turn too then, do this correctly. Yeah, Remember this part? Do this in the right order, yeah. It's uh we want a prism retrieval first. Hmm. Get a little more armor. It really feels strange that Morsels as a mechanic just get absolutely ruined by this boss. Well, I mean, they, they get ruined by you playing top floor. Yeah, but like you go the whole run playing top floor and then all of a hmm. sudden the game goes, actually, never mind, you can't do that here anymore. Yeah. Put crystalline seeds. Yeah. Oh, sure you know what would be cool? Enough. You know what would be cool, Boyx, for the next DLC? Here's here's my idea, right? Uh -huh. New new morsel just dropped. It's uh -huh. a morsel with phase. Oh. That would be interesting. So it's a, it's, yeah, so it can't be hit, but then it gets eaten. I'm down. Make it happen. That'd be pretty shoot. cool, I feel like. No, I shouldn't put that there. Or maybe like a relic that just gives all morsels face. I'm gonna let Primordia or Penumbra die this time also. Okay, that makes sense. Yo, you said Furnace Tap was never gonna have his time to shine? Well, well, well. Look what we have I'm here. Gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> destroy you. <laughs> but no, also putting Crystalline Seeds on the bottom. You'll rue the day. Like crystalline seeds on the bottom floor makes a big difference too, because then we don't replay shark mid floor. Yeah, it's a very minor numbers thing that pans out a lot more in your favor if you do it this way. Yep. We can use some morsel frontline inch. It'll take a little bit, but I think that that is okay. And actually, encanting has made it so we take only ten. Yeah. Yeah. Who, who who would have thunk that sabotaging your run with Furnace Tab would be a bad thing? I don't believe it. We could have. Like that sounds like some. That sounds like some. Uh, uh, oh fuck! So that sounds like some shark sharkist propaganda to me. Yeah, shark sharkist propaganda. I don't believe you. Oh, I also I, I I'm thinking of what you're doing there. You're trying to keep them alive by giving them a, a life steal morsel. Mm-hmm. Shouldn't you sap the back one so that way if it when it walks up it does less damage to the fire? Oh yeah, that's true. You're right. We took like six extra damage for that. Not a big deal. But no, I think actually this comes down to if we if we'd stopped and counted the bottom floor's damage output, we would have realized that the crystalline seeds down there would stop the fifteen and then the whole slide off the edge would stop. 
This is a. Uh, this is why I spend 95% of my episodes that look like they're completely one. Going okay, now here's how we can still lose. Here's how Bernie can still mm. lose. I guess he, uh, he already covered that base though. Hey, don't make fun of <laughs> don't make fun of TSM Bernie. TSM Bernie. Sorry, I didn't mean to. I should just be stacking staff on the divinity. Now it's unusable. Like now that now that we have done correct fundamentals, this is unusable. Hmm. Yes. There is no way. Impossible. Just uh, throw out these. Shark is a very important factor in this run, though. I, I would say the most important factor in this run, and we disrespect. Oh it. yeah. And what did we get? Where did that bring us? Well, now we play. Now, now we, now we play furnace tap. Yeah, absolutely. Now we play furnace tap. Get ready. No. Oh. At long last, furnace tap pops off. This is not the end. There we go. And look at that. We get to play because of perils. No. Well, I was gonna say, can you can you save? Penumbra, but no, he's fucking dead. I am, uh, for, for those of you watching the recording, to, to really round out this, uh, this mess of an episode, I tapped the side of my headphones and you heard a, a clip of Critical Role. Ah. Oh. Because my, uh, my what headphones. Were they, what were they doing? Uh, they are in the middle of campaign two and they were just talking. Okay. Doing some interpersonal banter isn't Maybe there like a whole thing about how they're starting a new a new season soon or something yeah the campaign 2 just wrapped up like two weeks ago maybe oh. i'll go in and i'll uh That's... silence that who knows i think they're doing i don't know what they're Let doing next leave. actually get me out of here voix <laughs> Yeah, all right, Cranberry? I gotta do stuff. I gotta do stuff, Voix. Uh, you know. I apologize. This was a pretty, no, uh, no, relatively quick... I don't know, this is an hour and 20 minutes, what the hell. I had was... a lot of fun. Yeah. Me too. I especially liked the part where I was a dolphin. Now, you know, ne ne next time, mm -hmm. come by for a, a, a more improv. Yeah. Um, do I... Adventures Wait. at SeaWorld. Quick, Cranberry, do a bit. Do a bit? Yeah, it's an uh, improv. Like a improv bit? Okay. Uh, I am a dolphin trainer at SeaWorld, and you are a person asking me a lot of questions about how we're really mean to the animals, and I try to play it off as being friends with the animals still. Okay, is it true that you elbow dropped a dolphin from the top ring and called it SeaWorld's opening event? No, no, that was WrestleMania. Oh, and they did WrestleMania, that was WrestleMania at SeaWorld. And and that wasn't me. That was John Cena. He oh. did it. He did not have permission to elbow drop our dolphins. We're still, it's, you know, I can't really talk it, say anything more about it uh, because we're, you know, the, the <laughs> legal proceedings are still happening. Mm -hmm. But uh, suffice to say, <laughs> John Cena is banned from SeaWorld for life. <laughs> Is it hard to ban John Cena due to the fact that you cannot see him? We have we have the technology. The, the, the dolphins echo locate him. When he did his title fight, was his saying, you can't see world me. <laughs> end it. End it. Get me out of here. Stop. <laughs> I give it a scene. Scene. And scene.